A New Mexico marital settlement agreement is a divorce compromise entered by a married couple looking to dissolve their marriage. Before heading to court, both spouses may draft this agreement prior to appearing before a judge, who would otherwise disperse the property under default rulings. A settlement agreement could, in some cases, cut time in court and costs. In this video, we'll take a detailed look at settlement contracts and their functions, as well as overview some legal requirements in New Mexico. Were eForms the world's biggest database of legal documents? Make sure that you watch to the end of this video where we'll give you a link to where you can make your own marital settlement agreement online, potentially saving you thousands of dollars during the divorce process. First, let's discuss the question of what is a marital settlement agreement? A marital settlement agreement records a divorce's predetermined terms and conditions that were mutually agreed upon by a married couple. Some of the most common topics addressed on the settlement include division of real and personal property, distribution of debts, custody of any children, owed alimony payments, and child support. The spouses can complete this document and present it in court in order to set their own terms for divorce, as opposed to having a judge decide for them. On top of that, the divorce can be processed quicker since it may avoid extended trial proceedings or mediation. Now, let's look at some of the legal requirements in New Mexico. New Mexico is one of the only nine states governed by community property laws. Community property laws state that all of the assets and money acquired by any of the spouses from the start of the marriage to the end of the marriage are effectively the property of the marriage. Under this structure, each spouse automatically owns 50% interest in all of the assets, money, and debts that were acquired during the marriage. Community property is generally divided equally after a divorce, but it varies from case to case, depending on the nature of the situation. Dispersions will be applied by a judge if both spouses cannot come to a mutual agreement through a settlement. With that in mind, a settlement agreement can be used in New Mexico to avoid such distributions by the courts. If both spouses agree on terms outside of an even split divide, they can file for an uncontested divorce using this contract to outline their desired conditions. And finally, residency requirements in New Mexico state. At least one spouse must be a resident of the state and must have resided in the state for six months before the date that they filed the petition for divorce. Following the divorce process to a T and drafting a predetermined settlement should substantially accelerate the procedure. Typically, the entire duration may be anywhere from 30 to 90 days. We're eForms, the largest database of legal documents. We have created an expansive and state-specific template that covers every last detail of the New Mexico Marital Settlement Agreement. To get this official template that can be used to file for divorce in your local circuit court, simply click on the link below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more daily videos.